ready to put on the finishing touches. Are you still getting dressed? She's not here. Hello? Maxie? Maxie? Maxie's not here. She's gone. Where could she be? <sighs> She's not here. I told you, she'd never risk Peter seeing her wedding dress before the ceremony. She's yeah. too superstitious. I know, but it still doesn't tell us where she is. You, uh, missing something? Yeah. The bride. Uh, Maxie, not Anna. So, how's Maxie? Ready for her big moment? Uh, we really couldn't say. Maxie's not in her room. And we looked everywhere. I've tried texting her. Nothing. I hate to worry you, Mac. We really have no idea where she is. Oh. Did Maxie mention James's drawing to anybody? No. Why? James drew a picture that said, Happy Wedding Day, Mommy and Daddy on it. And it really unsettled Maxie that James called Peter Daddy. Well, that's not surprising. It probably reminded Maxie that James's real daddy is Nathan, my good brother. Huh. Peter can live to be 100 years old, and he's never going to live up to Nathan. Um, I am going to go and... Keep looking for Maxie. You know, I, I don't disagree with Britt. Look, Nathan is a hard act to follow. And if Maxie's having second thoughts... Uh, may maybe she just needed a little space. You know, weddings can be overwhelming sometimes. Maybe she just, you know, thinks that she can't smile through it right now. Has the jitters. It's gonna be okay. I mean, you know, you, you try to talk yourself down and say that it's just a fancy party, but... You get to say in those vows, you know, for better and for worse. It's committing to a lot. And it's a lot to live up to.